Hello everybody, this is Abraham with No Short Computer Services. Uh, we have a situation here, and uh, here is the problem. So this computer, this MacBook Pro, has a firmware lock on it. So, uh, firmware lock on this particular computer is not easy to remove. You have to go to the Apple and they have to um, do whatever magic that they do is basically just re reflash the BIOS to get the um, BIOS to unlock. But I'm going to attempt to do it myself. I have this board here and it's from the same computer basically as this one and uh, I'm going to take the BIOS chip which is this chip here and transplant it to this computer and I want to see if it's going to um, get my BIOS unlocked if I'm successful good if not I can order the BIOS online so I will um, pause the video and see how we go about taking out the chip. So the chip on this board has been pulled out and uh, it is a regular BIOS chip. Uh, this board has a problem with it. It works but it has a problem. So we're going to now take this BIOS chip out. Let's see if I could. So we do that by basically warming up the chip with a heat gun and Healing it out. Simple as that. So, this is the chip from this board. Here's the chip that we're replacing. We're just going to reattach that one and see how it works. Okay. So the BIOS chip has been transplanted, the system has been cooled, let's see how it's going to go. <clears throat> Perfect. The Mac is unlocked. <clears throat> So to make a long story short, there is a way to get rid of the password on the Mac. Now one thing that I'm very curious about, it is the serial number of the computer. I'm hoping that the serial number hasn't changed, but it probably did because it's most likely etched in the BIOS chip. <clears throat> so we're gonna go to about this Mac. Okay, so the serial number, look on the back, is different. Okay, so it is what it is. So the Mac's got a different serial number on it, but hey, it works. <coughs> so to recap, <coughs> this is what happened. We have a board with... Um, that has a problem with uh, backlight. It still works, um, but I was able to transplant the BIOS chip from the bad board to 
good board that had a lock on it and everything's nice and peachy. Thanks for watching.